It's not so strange to find an occasional hole in your clothes every now and then, but it can get concerning if you've got holes in your rugs, drapes, or furniture too. If so, then you might be dealing with carpet beetles, tiny insects that will eat just about any fabric in your home. Treating carpet beetles is easy once you learn how, so in this video, we'll show you how to identify carpet beetles and treat them so your fabrics don't run the risk of getting eaten. To shop for the products featured in this video and learn more about carpet beetle control, click the icon in the top right of the screen or click the links in the description below. Carpet beetles are small, growing as large as 8 millimeters as larvae, then they end up about 5 millimeters long when they reach adulthood. This is only a fraction of the diameter of a US dime, so you'll need to keep an eye out. Adult beetles are oval shaped, and their markings can vary depending on species, but generally, you'll find varied and common carpet beetles with black, white, brown, orange, or even greenish looking patches. Black carpet beetles will have a consistent black color. Carpet beetle larvae do all the damage associated with carpet beetles. As larvae, they subsist off a diet of carotene and chitin, which can be found in non-synthetic fabrics, furs, feathers, or leather. They have color-banded bodies with contrasting colors, usually white or a light brown, and a darker brown. Their bodies are covered in hairs, which can cause skin irritation for some people. Black carpet beetle larvae don't have any hair, and they're a more solid brown or black color. Some people may confuse carpet beetles and bedbugs because of their similar appearance or the skin irritations beetle larvae cause. Some people may mistake these irritations for bed bug bites. You can tell the difference between a bed bug and a carpet beetle by first looking at the bugs themselves. Bed bugs will look like flat, brown, oval shaped insects that are about 4.5 millimeters in length, so similar to carpet beetles. Note the shape, since carpet beetles have more spherical bodies with varying colors, and they have wings. While carpet beetles eat fabric or pollen, bed bugs will bite humans and animals to feast on blood. Signs for carpet beetles are signaled by gatherings of adult beetles around windows and light sources. Common signs of bed bugs are black smears or blood spots that they'll leave on mattresses, blankets, pillows, curtains, or anywhere a bed bug could feasibly crawl to, along with skin shells, eggs, larvae, and the actual bed bugs themselves. If you've noticed holes in your clothes, bedding, or other fabrics, then you might already be dealing with a carpet beetle infestation. To make sure, you'll check around your home for adult carpet beetles and their larvae. Carpet beetles come from the outdoors, despite their name hinting at indoor habitations. People can get them by simply leaving a door or window open during the day. Adult carpet beetles are attracted to pollen and seek out abundant sources of fabric for their larvae to feed on. If you're the type to leave flowers by an open window, that's practically an invitation for carpet beetles to come inside. Carpet beetle larvae have been observed to be light sensitive, so you'll most likely find them in enclosed spaces like closets or drawers. You could also find them underneath or at the edge of carpeting along baseboards. In contrast to larvae, adult carpet beetles are attracted to light, so you might find them on windows or window sills. Once a carpet beetle reaches adulthood, they stop eating fabric. You may still find adult beetles among fabrics as they tend to lay eggs around their larvae's food source. Take note of where you've spotted carpet beetle activity as you'll focus your treatments in these spots. Once you've found signs of any beetles or larvae, you'll take some measures to prepare your space for treatment. Preliminary measures for carpet beetle treatment include common household tasks that anyone can do. First, vacuum your floors and other areas like rugs, curtains, and furniture. Be sure to vacuum along the floorboards and other tight spaces. Once you're done, immediately dispose of your vacuum's contents outside. Wash all fabrics with detergent and then dry them on high heat. The heat will kill any beetles, larvae, or eggs on these items. Be sure to wash clothes, bedding, towels, and other fabrics. If you have anything that can't be washed, like silk, place them directly in the dryer. Wipe down solid surfaces with mild soap and water. Clean windows and windowsills, shelves, the inside of drawers, desks, and tables to remove any possible food sources for adult carpet beetles. Once you finish cleaning, you're ready to start treatment. Be sure to put on your personal protective equipment or PPE, and be sure to keep people and pets away from treated areas until dry. You'll use an insecticide like Flex 1010 to kill and prevent carpet beetles inside your home. Flex 1010 is a safe and easy to use permethrin insecticide that can be applied indoors and outdoors to control for a wide variety of insects. Along with carpet beetles, Flex 1010 can also treat ticks, bed bugs, mosquitoes, and many other flying pests or crawling insects. 
To treat carpet beetles indoors, we recommend using a one gallon hand pump sprayer since you'll be making precise applications of the product throughout your home. For adult beetle control, you will need to mix 3.2 fluid ounces of Flex 1010 with one gallon of water. For a severe infestation, you can use the higher rate of 6.4 fluid ounces per gallon of water. Open the sprayer, add half a gallon of water, and add your measured amount of Flex 1010. Then add the remaining half a gallon, close the sprayer, and shake to ensure an even emulsion. Apply Flex 1010 along the baseboards and the edge of carpeting. Use a fan tip with light to medium pressure to moderately wet the areas, rather than soaking them. Be sure to also spray windows and window sills, shelving, drawers, closets, any cracks and crevices, and any other spots where you've seen carpet beetle activity. Once your Flex 1010 application has dried, treat gaps, holes, and other hiding places with defense dust. Defense dust is a dry, insecticidal dust that can be applied to voids, cracks, and crevices to treat carpet beetles and many other crawling pests. It also offers an 8-month residual if left undisturbed. Apply defense dust at a rate of half a pound per 1,000 square feet. To use defense dust, you'll need a handheld duster. Fill the duster about halfway with dust and leave plenty of room for air circulation. Squeeze the duster to apply the product. Apply defense dust at the edge of carpeting alongside baseboards where you've seen carpet beetle activity. You may also apply dust to any hard surface to crack or crevice where carpet beetles could be hiding. Applications should be light and uniform. Once you've treated your home for carpet beetles, you'll take preventative measures to stop any future infestations from happening. First, keep up with regular vacuuming, laundering, and cleaning. This will catch any stray carpet beetle that may have gotten in after treatment. Next, seal up any possible openings that carpet beetles can use to get indoors. Smaller openings can be sealed with caulk, but screens and door seals will need to be repaired or replaced. Once the openings are addressed, you can monitor insect activity with Catchmaster 72 MB glue boards. These glue boards will catch any pest that makes contact with the adhesive, so place these along pest entry points or in closets to see when pest activity is climbing. Finally, be sure to reapply Flex 1010 once every month for round-the-clock control. Flex will prevent carpet beetles from re-establishing themselves in your home and also control for other pests as well. Carpet beetles are tiny insects that will chew holes in your clothes and other fabrics, but you can control them yourself with these professional products and tips from Solutions Pest and Lawn. These products will help you get control of your carpet beetle problem, and we offer same-day shipping to help you get control quickly. Visit our website to get your products today. If you liked this how-to guide, please share. And if you're new to our channel, subscribe for more how-to and product videos, and contact us for more tips, tricks, and DIY pest solutions.